You guys, you're not gonna believe what we just went through. It was <laughs> so stressful. <laughs> so, uh, you know, we're fairly new homeowners and we've only just now coming this November, been in the house for two years. And we're still learning how to like fix things and do things on our own. You know, we've always lived in apartments where you can just call a maintenance person to like fix things for you, right? Can't really do that anymore. We gotta figure things out on our own. So <laughs> the kids bathroom toilet pump has been broken literally since like we moved in. So we decided to finally try to fix it. And we went to Home Depot today and got the pump and we, <laughs> We tried to fix it, and what happened? Water came gushing out. Just, is gushing the right word? Let's say, let's say? say first like of all, waterfall. we know there's a little nozzle next yes. to the toilet that you turn to turn the water off, and it didn't work. I turned it both ways, and for some reason it was still going, but then I thought, and then Logan said, well, what if it's, it's got to empty yeah. out? So I said, well, all right. So my, I, And I remember down here, when we did it, some water kept coming out, but it was- Not a lot. We were able to control it. We had put a bidet in this bathroom. Right. We did on both of our bathrooms. So and was, the water still trickled out even when we turned so it I off. So I was thinking- So we thought- The exact same scenario is gonna play out. Yeah. Where just a little bit of water will gush out. I have a bucket right here ready to go. Right, Logan? Yeah. Right here ready to go. And so, I screw it. Oh, I'm fine. And as soon as, as soon as it disconnected, as soon as it came off, Flood. An explosion of water everywhere, everywhere, just everywhere. It's so stressful. Oh my god. And so I'm downstairs, and they start screaming at me because, to okay, go outside so and I'm trying turn the water my off. My best to put it back in, because I'm thinking, oh, so let me just put it right back in. That way, it'll stop. I can re-screw it. Okay, something's happening. Maybe I forgot to turn it off again. I don't know. But I couldn't. I don't know how to turn the water off. So I tell the boys <laughs> in a full panic mode, yeah. boys, run downstairs and tell mommy to turn off the main I water did. valve. I did and, I, and I told them, but I don't tell know her, how to turn the water off. That was I, the you know thing. what? And you're right. And I, I meant to show you all the, the entire time that we've been here because your uncle, I mean, your um, brother. brother showed me. So anyway, um, so I tell them, tell mommy to turn off the, the main water valve is in front of the plants. Right there in front of the fence. Okay, wait, so I go outside and I find the irrigation water thing, whatever. So I think that's it. And I'm trying, I'm pulling it out. And this is like, there's an Amazon guy that pulls up. He's blasting his music while I'm trying to figure out how to do that. And I'm on the phone with my dad screaming like, I need help. I don't know what to do. I'm trying to turn the water off and I don't know how to do it. What do I do? And he, you know, and I'm just like screaming in the phone, trying to get help. And it's so funny because the Amazon guy's just there blasting his music, delivering packages. And I'm like thinking, I should ask that guy to help me. But like, he was all the way over there and I was trying to get my dad to help me. So then I didn't even know while I'm doing the irrigation thing, talking to my dad, he, he runs I outside run and finds the correct water thing. Because and I, I, turns I it remember off. from when your brother showed me. And I didn't even know because he ran back in the house. I, I'm still out there talking to my dad and I didn't even know that he had turned the water off already. So I'm like- And we used every <sighs> towel we own- Frantic. To dry it. Yeah, so all of so. our towels are dirty and being washed right now. <laughs> but my dad came over and helped us change the toilet pump. So now it's fixed and the water is back on and everything is good, but holy, that was the most stressful thing yes. that has happened since we moved into this house. Yes. And I jinxed myself because I had a feeling because I didn't know how to turn the water off that something like this was gonna happen. And I should have learned two years ago how to turn the water off. So if you own a well, house, make so sure we, you know how to turn your electricity off, your yes. power breakers off, your water off. Make sure you know how to do all of that stuff because oh my God, it's stressful to try to do it. We should in, definitely do a tour. In the middle of an emergency. Like, whew, that was crazy. We had a moment of quiet. And then I just came downstairs and I just said, you know what? And I think in order for us to process this, we have to get to the stage where we can laugh about it. So let's just start. Yeah, because we have to laugh about it because it was super yeah. freaking stressful. And now, good. So now we can get over it. And what we learned is now we know how to turn our water off. I know how, well, I guess he knew. I know how to turn the water off now. <laughs> and we know how to change the bathroom toilet pump. So yes. if we need to so, do that again in the future, we know how. Yeah. And we the, know to turn off the main water valve first. And the boys learned that you can come through a stressful situation and be okay in the end. Yes. <laughs> and they helped too. They both jumped oh, in, yeah. helped him Big clean time. up all the water, 
you know, they were they were helping like tremendously. So, and they even set the fan up there on the floor for us so that the carpet in the bathroom can dry. So, yeah. <sighs> anyway, now I'm cooking dinner. Oh, my arm hurts from holding the phone. My dinner is tofu, broccoli, peppers, red onion, some garlic, some onions, some ginger, some Bragg's liquid aminos, and some maple syrup, and I'm making some black rice in the Instant Pot. So that is what we're having for dinner. We're gonna relax now and chill, and anyway. <laughs> Let me know if you've ever had a house emergency that you've had to deal with and how you dealt with it. And anyway, thanks for being here, my little broccoli bites. I'll catch you in the next video. Bye. <laughs>